Oh boy. Uh, so, welcome back everyone. I'm feeling a little uh, off, even though I got a pretty good night's sleep last night. So, I really would like to just take a walk, alright? You know, do my little exercise thing. But, uh, yeah, I think I'd rather just get these videos out of the way. Because today is actually going to be a pretty light day, alright? Three minor projects and a uh, soon to be launching Seifu Titano Fork. It's actually launching in about three hours. But, I mean, as usual, I'm just, like, just so out of it with uh, the Titano forks in general. Uh, but, thankfully, Titano and Sphere are coming back slowly, all right, along with the crypto markets. So, you know, I'm chilling, all right? Because, again, I'm in Sphere. I'm not in Titano, but I still keep track of Titano because, you know, like Bitcoin, you know, even though I don't actually have Bitcoin, I still very much track it, right, because, you know... The person in the alpha male in the front, you know, leads the rest of the wolf pack kind of thing, all right? Eventually, Sphere will become the alpha male uh, in, in the space, but, well, you know, Titan has been around, obviously, since the beginning of this concept, so, yeah. <clears throat> so, anyway, so before I actually start on ABAX miners, I was actually thinking, if I were to create my own miner project, I would actually try to figure out, like, you know, what's something we haven't seen yet? And to be honest, the one I haven't really seen yet is wrapped Bitcoin and wrapped Ethereum on Binance Coin. I think that could actually work because no one's done it yet. Right? Everyone's just competing again for the same base tokens. Right? <clears throat> so it's actually so everything's actually starting to get oversaturated. And if I were to expand in the Phantom, because Phantom's got the suit the super predator problem, because a spooky miner keeps going down. It's now down to two hundred and sixty thousand Phantom. I'm actually thinking you have to have a very harsh tax system. So let's say I were to offer 10% daily APR on Phantom, right? Well, your deposit tax is going to be like 15%, and the withdrawal tax is going to be like 20%. I'm going to like punish the hell out of you. <laughs> so, but it'll keep it sustainable, right? You know, I guess I could lower the deposit tax to like, you know, 12% or 10% even. So basically I would cop be copying like Titano. Right, but the I would draw attack is definitely gonna be like twenty three, twenty five percent. All right, I mean I have I have to hit the dumpers hard. So and that's in addition to the supposed like anti whale mechanism, which from what I can tell actually does not exist. It doesn't work. Right, it's just that everyone just says that it honestly doesn't work, or maybe it does. Or here's the thing, I've actually noticed that what happens is as more money goes in and out, your rewards decrease anyway. Because other people are constantly, you know, getting their own little miners or whatever you want to call it. So that actually is what, you know, determines your rate of return. So that that's what I'm personally seeing. So that's really what's going on, I think. Obviously, I could be wrong. But I'm just going by on what I'm observing. Because now that I have so many of these... Because <coughs> I have so many of these miner projects. All next to each other, right? Binance coin, Binance coins, uh, you know, Phantom with Phantom, AVAX with AVAX, etc., etc. I can actually see side by side, you know, what my earnings actually are. And because everyone's just forking and copying each other's code, the amount of like miners or skeletons or whatever, you know, they call it, are actually kind of like the same because they're all using the same code. So I'm actually able to get some really good data off of this stuff. So. All right, so you know that's just a thought, right? Obviously, I would just simply avoid Phantom anyway, because I don't know. There's just obviously that that thing has, just has a lot of problems, you know. But with that being said, I'm still making you know an all right decent income from it, so whatever. All right, so anyway, uh, this is called AvaxMiners.com. Uh, not a fan of like the red on red, so obviously you can't really see this. Uh, it's a little too much for me personally, the red, but whatever, right? I mean, you don't come here for the looks, right? Although that would be nice. So I got this from Yada Crypto. In fact, all the projects from today come from Yada Crypto. So uh, he talked about this today. Uh, so I think they launched yesterday. All right, here's their Twitter. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, they're definitely very brand new. Uh, for how FTAVX, hi, uh, blah, 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 blah. yeah, so, I feel like we're going to come out tomorrow, yeah, 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 okay, so, alright, so, 
Whatever. So I guess Yada is just picking. I don't know how. I don't know how Yada finds these things. I would like to know how he finds these things. Then maybe I can go back to the source. Otherwise, I guess I'll just feed off of this YouTube because I didn't actually check the other channels. All right. Uh, because yeah, I figured we already have four videos for today. Because I was supposed to do Gates of Heaven, but apparently they're actually not not launching their Titano fork. Uh, they're actually switching to a ten percent. Uh, BNB miner, believe it or not, and with a 6% developer tax. So, you know, I'm actually kind of excited about that because, I mean, they have a lot of fake followers, but they still have an okay engagement, right? Well, more than me, anyway. So, you know, Gates of Heaven will probably be a miner project, that's, so that's going to be good. I mean, it kind of sucks because I have so many freaking BNB miners, and now I have more tabs being opened every day. So, it's kind of getting uh, out of hand here. I might have to actually find out what that website is where you can connect all your minor projects and then you can do everything with just like one click. I might actually need to do that. Right? It, yeah, so maybe that's something I'll have to look into. Actually, you'll probably have to look into that too. I'll actually make a separate video about that, believe it or not. And then I'll actually probably post it on like the the strategy playlist, right? Uh, like both, both playlists. So, yeah. So anyway, this project obviously just launched. It's on AVAX, of course. And yeah, so the AVAX is actually going up a little bit. Uh, not too bad. Uh, so I already have three AVAX projects already. I have uh, AVAX Spooky Miner. I have a uh, Ruby Mine, of course, the best one. And I have Fish Farm Money, which is doing okay. They're still at 38. Okay, well, I guess they're not so okay. So now they're down to 37, whatever. So you look at Fish Farm, they have a 5% differential between daily ROI and dev packs, right? Uh, this one's 6% differential. So, eh, I don't know. It's like, I think sustain. I think 5% really is the cutoff. And that's already, like, pretty difficult. The problem is everyone sees baked beans, and they think they could just do the same thing, just copying and paste. You know, it's... Uh, you know, it's, it's generally pretty lazy, right? So, you know, it's, and it's starting to actually show up everywhere in, like, other minor projects, which is getting, which is actually kind of annoying me. So, but, anyway, there's not really much to say. Obviously, I'm not going to borrow the white paper. This is just a copy and paste of, like, you know, I really want to know. What is the, ter what is the dev that they're all using, all right? And I, uh... Okay, I will fork baked beans in various networks. I don't see any things. Uh, there's got to be someone here. I will fork a baked beans fork that it is starting at 150. I'll fork baked beans platform. Okay, 19 services available. Okay, is there anyone here that has? Doesn't help that. <laughs> uh, the problem that I have is we don't know if any of these people are trustworthy. They're like literally brand new. Alright, he'll fork on all this. He's a member since they, Yeah, like, you gotta be careful about scammers. Because even if they do what they say they do, they may actually like hold the, like own the contract and then there's one day rug pull from you. So... And, and then you get your left st stuck with the bag. Okay. How about this guy? Do you, do you seem uh, trustworthy? No, member since April 2022. <laughs> Verified honey pot new version. What? Okay. Yeah, this, would, this is the hardest part is finding a reliable developer. So how about this guy? He's charging 400 bucks. Did I find someone that is... Well, he's charging a lot more money. He's got... See, this guy might seem a little more trustworthy. He's from last month. Uh, what is show? I will fork baked beans. I have baked beans contract, baked beans DeFi. Okay, so he definitely knows to... Oh, God, my eyes. So it's BNB miner, and he's definitely working on that. Okay, so I would probably hire this guy. This is pretty cheap. Simple. If you're, if I'm really cheap, I would do this one. 
uh, customized front end development, but I mean, if you really want to do a good job, you probably need to pay this, and then you got to figure out like you know marketing. That's the only hard part about this is figuring out how you how do you market this shit. And then you would probably have to put your own money in this just so that there's something in there, all right? Because nobody wants to go first. Uh, people who read their service also did. Okay, I will create. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so there. Yeah, so there's. See, so I would, I would maybe hire this guy. So I would actually, I'm actually gonna probably bookmark this person. Great experience with the seller. Great. I wish I knew what what he hired him for. So he'll do all these other things. I'll fork this. I'll develop NFT mining, NFT staking. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, okay. So he, so he, so someone hired him to fork a Titano project. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna actually save this guy's. Because uh, I'm actually thinking about making my own miner project, believe it or not. If you want to make your own miner. Yeah, cause that's not, cause that's not a bad, that's not a bad thing. So, all right. So anyway, there's not really much, cause it's obviously a minor project. Obviously, this these videos could be like three minutes long. But obviously, you know, I like to ramble and more importantly, do research. So obviously, I am not going to invest in this, cause obviously it's too new. You know, it, you know, uh, I need, I want to see a higher tax differential, right? And on top of that, I already have a bunch of projects. That's that's actually. That's actually another problem going forward with new minor projects is because there's just too much uh, there's too much saturation. So uh, to be So I want to go here because I want to actually look at I want to look at how the hell where does this take me? I assume the baked beans, right? Bean chart. Oh, uh, what? So they hold an AMA. Yeah, how are they actually marketing this thing? That's what I don't actually get. Best in solid community across 16,000 members. Uh huh. Yeah, how were they able to do this? That's the, like the hardest fucking part about this shit. Yeah, you have to figure out the marketing. All right. Anyway, I don't really have anything new to say. So you can check out this site if you want. You can also try it. I mean, obviously it's like a, about a one day old. But me personally, I'm gonna pass. All right, because again, I already have, I already have, I, I'm already earning eight percent on three other projects already. So and they have higher tax rates. Right? And believe it or not, I actually want a higher tax rate because, again, you need these projects to sustain itself. So, this 6%, I mean, unless they have some kind of marketing thing, like, like I, again, I don't know how you would market this. Like, I don't know how these guys are marketing each other. But, you know, whatever. Other than that, I mean, you'll get in early if you want to do this, but, you know, whatever. It's up to you. So, oh, and uh, thank you, by the way, to everyone who is new. This channel is actually growing like crazy. I'm actually still getting new subscribers from that Sphere video that I did like a couple days ago. So thank you guys and gals. So anyway, uh, so if you're new, welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here. And for the... So that's actually interesting. I noticed now that on the OBS that the word AVAX before AVAX Myers actually looks much clearer than on here where I can't freaking see it. So that's actually very interesting. So you actually... So you might actually see it easier than I do here, because my screen shows like this thing is basically merging with the background. I can barely see the word AVAX up here. That's very interesting, huh? Interesting. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I'll see you all in the next video. Like, subscribe, share this video around. Let's grow the channel. Let's keep growing it, all right? I actually noticed that we're at like 1414 subscriber count here. So you know, we're, we're actually growing at a very reasonable rate that I like. So I think finally people from the other side of the world finally got around to watching uh, my videos. So, okay. So the next project we're going to cover is, looks like Bomb BNB. So I got this, of course, from Yada Crypto, and the, it's much easier on my eyes. So that's always a nice thing. All right, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. And uh, again, check out AVAX Miners.